Hi guys, in today's video I'm just going to be showing you a haul. I got loads of stuff including some new fish. I did say I was going to get betters but I actually didn't. So I will show you the, the fish last just because I want you to wait. So most of the stuff is pet related. Um, there's about two things that aren't pet related so I'm going to show you them. First, so the first thing is some prized papaya it's like a type of fruit and it's like sugared and it's really nice i really like this i got this from holland and barrett so yeah I and mean, this was about three pounds something yeah i think it was three pound fifteen and then i got this huge pack of hubba bubba gum hubba bubba bubble gum there's like loads of different flavors and i'm actually going to do a video on tasting these um there, it says there's five raw mixes, but I think two of them are exactly the same. So there's just three, well four basically, that are different flavours. So then the next thing I got, you guys are probably going to give me a bit of hate, but it's just a hamster ball. And I am not using this like a little hamster ball, I won't um, close this... God. I won't close this bit off. I will just put them in their playpen with this open. So if they want, they can go in and run. That's what I'm gonna do. And it's really tiny, so yeah, that's a shame. It did come with a. St it said it would come with a stand, but it didn't, y'all. Yeah, but you know, it also said it was coloured, and it's completely see-through. But never mind. It's really tiny, and yeah. So the next thing is just a dustpan and brush you're probably thinking how is that pet related well this is what i'm going to use to um clean the hamster's cage i'm just going to use this and this um little brush has some really pretty pattern i was like sort of diamondy sort of stuff not real diamonds obviously and then because it was on sale and we had a voucher for it so it costed 50p um we got some harry hamster food in america this is called hazel hamster but yeah so I've just got a bag just in case I run out. And yeah. And then I got one second. A woodland um small it's just small play sticks, but it's like a, a bendy bridge. Let me just get the thing off. And I'm gonna just take away one of their nests because it's got a hole in because they were chewing it. I'm just gonna put this in like that because I really like bendy bridges. Um, and I'm just going to say quickly, I was going to actually buy a strawberry hidey house, but all the ones they had were sharp around the room, so I didn't in the end. And now we're getting near to our fish, so I'll just show you the plants first I got. So I just got, oh, and by the way, this first pen and brush was pound. Um, Harry Hamster was 50p, and this was three pounds, the little friendly bridge. So I got these in a pack of five for five pound, which is a pretty good deal. No, a pack of six for five pound, which is a pretty good deal. Um, so yeah, and so this is the first one. I don't know. I don't really like this one, but it's all right. It's just got three bits on it, so it's pretty boring. It's not too sharp, so don't worry. It looks kind of sharp. All of them look really sharp, actually, apart from no, all of them pretty much. But I did make sure they were soft. And yeah, so I'm not sure which tank this is going in. I'm not really a big fan of it, but we'll see. And then I got this one. And I actually must say there are these little sharp knobbly bits that come off. So I think I'm going to put this either in the big tank or the sorority. But I'll probably put it in the big tank because I don't want my sorority girls like Blue Beauty and Brooklyn who have long fins to get nipped. Like, not nipped, but like, you know, like scratched by the plant then next is this plant now i actually quite like it when i first saw it i thought it was quite boring but i actually kind of like it you can probably guess that this is a natural theme little sort of um pack so yeah um but this i actually kind of like it's really sweet it's really soft and i think this is gonna go in either marshmallow's tank or um hook fang's tank i'm not sure then the next plant I got um, was just this one. I really like this one actually. It's got the leaves like a sort of like a um, fern. And then they have these sort of red leaf bits coming off as well. And it's really pretty. 
and I really like this one. Then this is, I think, my second favourite. And this has, by the way, that was probably, like, that's not one of my favourites, but I do quite like that one. This is my second favourite, my favourite one I'm going to show you next. But this is my sef second favourite, I say, for the 50th time. And it's like a, um, ivy leaf, sort of. It's really sweet, I really like this one, and this is definitely going in Marshmallow's tank. I have put it in there to see if he likes it. He's swimming, um, he swam by it, so I think he likes it. Then this is my favourite one, and it's like grass, and I'm not sure which tank I'm going to put it in. But I want to put it in a better tank. I might also put this in Marshmallow's tank as well. But we'll see. I've got an idea of maybe putting it in the Jilsicle tank, but we'll see about that. I'm not sure about doing that. And now on to the fish. I was going to get um, two Malbaters and... Um, this deformed fish, he's been there for months, but apparently he's not allowed to be sold because of his deformity. And then um, I was going to get some black skirt tetras as well. But instead, I just got four Congo tetras for the sorority. And I've got the female betas. They're just in this tub floating. So if... Um, so they um, are they're introduced at the same time with these guys so they're not too aggressive at them and I got these all this stuff apart from the dustpan and brush and the um, two foods and the hamster ball I got everything else from pets at home I did actually buy some treats but me and my mum actually can't find them in the bag so we're guessing they fill out the bag or something but I did get some like rainbow sticks which weren't to be for hamsters but anyway, these are my Congo Tetras. There's four of them, like I said, and they're really cute. I'm just going to float them now in the sorority, and I will. I'm doing tank tours later, it was suggested. Um, and I am doing my Q&A in about, I think, maybe on Friday, by the way, guys. So yeah, I hope you like this little haul. Please like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. My hands look being so cute. And yeah, bye!